Welcome Forks for Beginners family. Okay, so today we're setting up our broker account. We need a broker account for two reasons. To place trades. So we need to open and close trades. Also, while we're learning, we're going to start a demo account within our live account. And so we can learn free of worry of losing money or gaining money. Right now we're just in the learning phase, so we're going to open up a live trading account, but we're going to create a demo account, a demo account within it. Okay, so when you click on the link I provided you, we're going to, it's going to bring you to this page here, Hugo's Way FX. So this is uh, the recommended trading broker. So once you come to this page, it's going to be a free account. It doesn't charge you anything there. So just put in your name, uh, your uh, last name, your best email address, and pick a strong password. Agree to the terms and click open the live account. What it's going to do, it's going to send an email to your email address here. And it's going to say, thank you for signing up for Eagles Way. Please click on this link right here to verify your account. Once you click on that link, it's going to take you to this page here. So it's going to want you to just uh, verify your name, uh, your email address, put in your phone number, put in your birth date, select what gender, male or female, put in the address, your actual address, make sure all of this information is correct, especially your address and your name and your phone number. This is a real tr live trading account. Uh, so eventually when you do go live and you make profit, you're gonna need uh, this information accurate because they need to send, when you have profit, they send money to your bank account. So your, your account info needs to match what you have in your bank account. So once you've entered all this information, just click on uh, this button right here. It'll bring you to this login page. So then your account set up, all you need to do is log in. So put in your email address, put in your password that you set, and hit login. And so now, give it a second. Okay, so now we're in our trading account. This is what you call the back office. So here, uh, you have a menu on the left here, so dashboard, buy accounts, deposit funds, internal transfer, withdraw, uh, ver ver this is verifying your accounts, but you still have to do, do a little bit more verification. So uh, here, so we're going to click on verification. So we just want to get this out of the way. This is uh, just to finish actually setting up your account. So because it has to do with, uh, you know, making money and, depositing funds and receiving funds, there's still a little more set up here. So they want to make sure that uh, the information you put in your account is actually valid. So uh, you don't want to make up any fake accounts. When you're setting up a broker account, we need to uh, put in our right information. So what we're going to do so far here is we're going to go to this verification tab right here and click on it, and it's going to bring up this screen. So pretty much they're asking for just your proof of your ID. So right now the first step says to upload proof of ID. So it could be uh, a, a passport. It could be a government issue ID, say like a driver's license. I would say use your driver's license is probably the best. Um, and here it also says a driver's license. So any sort of government ID, driver's license, or passport. So proof of ID type, you want to select any one of these. Uh, I went with driver's license and then um, you really you need to take a picture of your ID and uh, once you have the picture you just drag it into this box right here and hit upload document. So uh, let me see if I can just put something there. One second. Um, so say say this file right here, say this file was my ID. So I would just drop it in there. So it says driver's license. I dragged it in here and then click on upload. So once it's uploaded, it'll say the document successfully uploaded. So you you so this is telling you you've completed uploading your proof of your ID. So next step, this is the last step here, it's uploading proof of address. So you, like I said, you needed, you needed to enter correct information for uh, your broker account. So I'm just turning that sound off. <laughs> okay, so next step is uploading proof of address. So a recent bank statement dated at least three months or a recent utility bill or a credit card statement. So 
select what you want here. So say a utility bill, say like a, um, yeah, so say like a home bill or credit card statement, whatever you have. So bank statement, credit card statement, utility bill. The same thing, you're gonna select utility bill and uh, you can either drag it in here or just click on here and you can look up where your ID is. So you're gonna need a picture of your, or, or a screenshot of your uh, address on a, a bill. You just select the file, it'll go in here, or you can drop it in here and then go upload ID. And it'll say upload to complete it. You just hit OK. And then it'll say your document's been uploaded and it's pending approval. So this is pretty much completes verifying your account. So we upload our ID, proof of address, and now they're, we're waiting to verify the account. So that's all we're going to do for this, uh, this uh, module here. So we've set up our account. And the next module will be about uh, setting up your demo account. So we'll see you soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.